Lucas Media. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. So Derek Chauvin, the accuser, or accuser, the killer of George Floyd, who was convicted of murdering George Floyd back in 2020, was stabbed today at a federal prison in uh, Tucson. Now they're saying that the stabbing happened around 12.30 p.m. And he was treated for life-saving measures, but it looked like he'll be okay. He's going to live. And he'll be able to spend the rest of a couple decades in jail. Now, for those who don't know who he is, he was accused of putting, well, so in video of him putting his neck on George Floyd until George Floyd crossed over into history, which caused not only outrage in many Minnesota, but outrage throughout America and all over the world. You've seen people rioting. You've seen people from all parts of the globe marching out in peace over it. And it got so bad to where the powers that be had to have him go to jail. He had to do some time over that. And there was no reason why, why George Floyd lost his life. And I mean, you can just Google the video. Like I said, unless you live under a rock, y'all know who this who this guy is. But yeah, somebody ran up on him in jail. He got stabbed up. It don't say what it's about. But he was moved to a medium facility. Which, again, if you're somebody like him, I mean, when you want to have him under 24-hour protection because his name, he's just such a big person as far as within the prison system. And uh, also, one more thing, George Floyd, before he crossed over in the history, he was crying out for his deceased mother and talking about how he couldn't breathe and it's just it was just a sickening thing so when you see things like this happen to Derek I mean I'm gonna I'm gonna keep my comments really to myself for the sake of YouTube's guidelines but I mean it is what it is right not surprised especially when you know when you when you a high profile person like that you're gonna have enemies And also, he had his knee on his neck for nine and a half minutes as well. I forgot to mention that as well. So, you know, when people see him in jail, and when people see people like George Zimmerman, you know, they had an anger in them. You know? But yeah, it looked like he'd be all right. You know, he still got a couple more decades to go in jail. So, it is what it is with him. But I just want to share a quick video about it. Look like he got stabbed up in jail. What's y'all thoughts?